that's not good. Okay, easy there, dude. Oh, he's blowing stuff off of me. Ooh, holy cow, what the heck? That's a big wheels. Whoa, they got like guided missiles, man. Man, how hard is that dude's shield? What the heck is going on? Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are back playing Terra Tech, and for today's episode, we have several missions that we need to catch up on, and we need to also kind of expand on this territory that we're currently in. So in the last episode, I had actually wandered all the way over to the other side of the map over here. So we were last in this area, which was kind of like a little flatlands, kind of like, I don't know, like a salt flat type area. I don't know if there's any salt or anything over there, but it was just very flat and no rocks or hills or anything. So it's kind of interesting little area. And I needed to get back over to kind of one of the original areas that I had set up a little mining operation. And I noticed that while I was over in this area, I noticed that my money wasn't going up and I'd set up this little mining operation over here and apparently we have to kind of stay within a certain range, I guess. So maybe like we have like these little square quadrants, you know, on the map. So maybe we need to stay within this little quadrant for us to get the get the money from the, the mining. So let me show you kind of what I've done because, oh yeah, also over here there was a like, I don't really know, I kind of just stumbled across it, but it was like a little spaceship thing and it was floating and so we did this or i did a little mission uh, this was kind of off camera and i ended up getting this little anchor system that is like i guess supported by a little beam and i can kind of move around so you can see i kind of i can like drag it along but what's nice is it just plants anywhere so i don't have the issue anymore of like trying to anchor my machine down in a certain location or whether i'm on a hill or whatever so that's very, very nice that I kind of came across that. I think one of you guys had mentioned that in one of the episodes and or one of the comment sections on one of the episodes, but I wasn't really sure where that was. So I did find it though. Okay, so let's look at what we have going on over here. So I have this little mining operation that are, oof, what the heck? Let me actually just zing to one over so we can actually teleport or control it. And I have like, the little geocorp rig mining rig right here this little auto miner setup and this is a little faster than this one over here which is the gso auto miner so i like this one because it's just a little bit quicker now i did find this little pacemaker thing i don't know if i have it in the right spot or whatever but it doesn't seem to really change where you know no matter where i put it but it, I have it set to turbo speed and what it's doing is like as soon as something ejects out of here it, it, it's kind of acting weird right now but it goes through see how fast it's going and getting shot off um, so I'm refining it and we get more money for it when we refine it like that there might be another level of refining that we can do too maybe even get more money out of these so I noticed these little green veins and the yellow ones I, I don't remember what mineral they are we get more money from from those than we do like the little jelly thing over there so so i have one that's just standard and one that is set up with this uh, geocorp rig and then what i did is I, I put little cabs on each one of them so that i can actually save them and then load them as a tech so like right here i can click on one and then i can say deploy a new tech and it will just automatically deploy one right there and then we just kind of switch over to it and stick it into the ground. And if there was like a mineral vein right here, it would just start mining and making money and stuff like that. It just kind of picked up some stuff off the ground. But And then if I can't get it lined up just right, then we can take it over and then I can kind of like move it around a little bit, you know, and then set it back down and mine it again. So pretty, pretty handy little thing. Let's go back to our rig, our, our tank thing, and then we'll, we can store that away so i've set up a few of these in this location i had a whole bunch going at one time i actually got up to about six hundred thousand in little build buck blocks or block bucks or whatever they're called and ended up buying quite a few things to kind of upgrade our little tank machine right here and so 
Not a whole lot has changed from my other configuration except for I added the tank treads and the bigger tires. Other than that, it's still the same kind of blocky thing <laughs> with the same three giant batteries on it. I did pick up an extra large battery too, but I haven't figured it out, or not really figured it out, but I haven't really placed it or played around with it because it's, it's kind of big and I have to reconfigure my cab and my whole little setup a little better. But right now we're pretty like serious. I mean, look at that, you know? I mean, we can take on some, some big enemies and I have to keep putting these things down because I end up still collecting all that stuff. So we have someone coming in over here, looks like. Let's go over here. The first thing they do is they start attacking my little thing. So that's just a little guy. Oh, we found a, what did that say? It said it found a titanium seam. Is that what this is? Is that titanium? I don't know what that is. No, that's your, your der, der right. <laughs> Maybe this is titanium. That looks like, yeah, there it is. Or tint, tintonite, something like that. So, yeah. So we're pretty powerful right now. Now, there are these like Hawkeye things that come along. We seem to be getting more into some difficult creatures and not creatures, but tech machines. And so it's getting a little harder as far as those guys appearing. So here's another re little refinery thing. So let's go and look on our mission deal here. We need to kind of go, let's remove that. I want to head right here. We have a big cluster of stuff going on. So I feel like that is something, every time I run into a cluster, there's like some kind of event thing that we can get a lot of parts from. So let's just head that way. We're just gonna clear out. And if the trees get in my way, I just kind of mow them down like this. And that seems to work pretty good. I did find a bigger repair bubble too. So we do have a much bigger one that's really covering the majority of our vehicle now. And I still have the magnet enabled. So let's go ahead before the sun goes down. Let's recharge for a minute. I'm gonna suck all this stuff off of my dude real quick. And we can kind of do this. So let's recharge for a minute. Okay, so we've got the recharging. So now we're just gonna go to this little exclamation point on our map here. And I'm just gonna cream over all this stuff. There are all those trees. I don't know if that's the best way to do that, but I'm not gonna worry about getting all these parts over there for that thing. We're gonna head over here. Looks like there are some, oh my gosh, those are some big dudes. Do they see us? Before I go into a battle like that, I'm gonna save. Okay, so all saved up. Now let's just head over here and see what the heck we can do. And see so if we can take out these guys. So I can usually disable them pretty quick. Some of these guys are harder though, holy cow. So he's still left around. Wow, there's a bunch. I'm gonna go ahead and set this thing here. Suck in all that stuff. I don't wanna, if I don't do it now, then we'll lose a lot of parts. There we go. So those dudes are taking somebody out over there. What in the world? Uh oh, what am I stuck on? Am I stuck on somebody? That's not good. Okay, easy there, dude. Oh, he's blowing stuff off of me. Uh oh. This is not good. I got somebody stuck under me. Let's just... Can I run him over? Oh, we lost our shields. Oh boy. I need to get these guys out of here. Okay, got that dude. Look at that guy running after us. These guys are hard, man. Holy cow. License upgrade three. Destroyed mission complete. Okay, nice. Man, that was a mess. So I'm assuming my thing doesn't really once we lose weapons and stuff, so I think I lost a cannon. I did, dang. 
Okay. Well, maybe we've gained one. Let's look over here under the Hawkeye and then weapons. Oh, we got some other naval. What the heck is that? But I lost the other thing that I had like right here. So we have an auto cannon. And one of the other things I found I didn't realize I had was this giant thing right here, which is a battleship cannon. So look at that thing. It's a naval gun and this is a holy cow. Okay. Well, I'll take that, and then we'll see about rebuilding here as soon as I can get some power. Um, let's move this thing over here, all of this craziness. See, that's what I mean, like, you know, when I see a big cluster of people, it's, you know, I know it's going to be like a crazy, uh, like a crazy little attack thing. So where's my little thing at? There it is. Okay, so I have another little guy thing that's a little black hole right here. I have this thing too. So I don't know which one is better. You know, they seem to do about the same thing. But this one, I really don't know. Is one more powerful than the other? Whoa, maybe one is more powerful than the other. Maybe we'll start using that. That seemed to grab stuff from a long distance. Let's grab this block over here. I need the sun to come up so I can repair. That's a big block. I have a giant magnet too on the back that I've upgraded. And this it's, seems to be heavy. So hopefully we can get it close to this thing and suck it in. Yeah. Okay, so maybe that's the difference between that is it has a little bit further range. Something just flew over me. Oh yeah, it sure did. Alright, we need to charge up, but there is no way to do that right here. Do we have a outpost or whatever we do right there? The trading station. Well, I don't want to do the supply drop because we are in no condition to do that. I want to, I want the sun to come back up. Let's run over to this little station over here because we can repair, repair ourselves a little bit. So I got my little tech rover all fixed back up with missing blocks and stuff. I was missing this corner piece and so that was the only block that I was missing and you know I think there's a few guns and stuff that I got blown off. Oh yeah I had a nail gun right there so that is gone as well. So but we have the majority of it back together plus some new stuff. I found a <clears throat> new I found a new shield by the Black Hawk Corporation and so I put that on so I have kind of like a couple of shields in there all squeezed in. I don't know if that makes a difference or not, but let's go over here. There is a, I don't know what it is. It's an abandoned tool crate. Let's go find that. That sounds interesting. I stayed up way too late playing this thing. It's a little addicting to say. A tool crate. So where is this tool crate at? There's a lot of trees right here. I'm just going to take down all these trees. Little dude right there. There we go. I see it. I'm stuck on something. I really don't like getting stuck on little tiny things. Here is the tool crate. Now let's see if bad dudes pop in. Has not return yet? Go ahead and take it. Okay. Ooh, holy cow. What the heck? That's a big wheel. So I want to use this. Which one is it? Is that it? Okay. That seems to cover a wider radius. I don't know if we need that for collecting heavier things or what. All right, so we have an outpost over here we need to go seize also, but something just flew in over here. It's a big giant, I don't know, it looks crazy. Another Blackhawk thing. So let's take it down. What the heck, that was a big thing right there. Whoa. That's gonna be some good parts. Okay, now let's do the mission over here. Okay, we have some kind of base thing over here we need to take out. Right, let's see if we can get that thing over there. There's a thing going on way over there too. Let's go around. Ooh, he, that dude's fast. Oh, look at all these guys. Oh, no. Uh, 
Uh, do we have some people about to pop in on us? So much stuff on me, I can't move. I sit in the middle of this dude right here. There we go. Knock up that tree. Right, there we go. All base guardians are down. Congrats, the base is yours. Okay, cool. Oh. So what base is this over here? So when we collect these bases, what is that? That's a weird, it looks like a piece of furniture. What in the world? So what do we do with these bases? Like I've taken a couple of these and it seems like they all are supposed to do something, but look at this crazy thing. Can I, does it have a cab on it that I can port, teleport to? Oh, it does, okay, good. Let's save this thing. Let's take a snapshot. Harvest base. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Let's save it. And what is it? Is it, are these just procedurally made? Like, it seems like it's half embedded into the ground. How is things supposed to go through there? Can I move this? Like, if I do this, we move it over a little bit. Maybe, maybe it'll plant better okay so it seems to be doing things i think that's been kind of my problem lately with finding some of these is that maybe they're pro procedurally like located and so they're on these weird terrains and it doesn't seem like everything is working or the base is broken so it is not doing anything can i figure out how to make this work um uh, hmm Okay, so we have conveyor belts going this way. Is is that is that how you're supposed to do that? Is that like a conveyor belt hack to put it sideways like that? Weird. Okay, I see like little boxes. Do we have like an on switch? <laughs> I don't know what it's supposed to do, guys. Like it seems like maybe. Let's see, that's a battery. It's got a million shield things and repair things around it. So something's supposed to come up here and dump it into these things. So it looks like it's a money-making thing or something like that. So where where's the input? Does it have one? Oh, here we go. So it comes in on here. And it goes around, down. And this has a filter on it. Oh, whoa, okay. So it's, do we know what it's set to filter right now? Filter specific chunks. Okay. I mean, it looks like, oh, I see. So maybe it's, well, no, it looks like something made it through. Yeah, so it's filtering out wood and then it's coming around to this block. And then, then where? Where is it supposed to go after that? Wondering if something got blown up. You know, that's the problem with attacking these bases is that they take a little collateral damage. So where is it supposed to go? So it's coming down. Looks like it's supposed to go over there. Is it missing a piece? Sorry, I'm all, I'm making you guys seasick. I'm sorry. Okay, so we have it coming up and into here and it's going through this conveyor belt and then on the inside let's look around in here maybe there's a missing piece right there oops I changed the direction okay so maybe there's a missing piece but it, it comes around over here no go back the other way I'm trying to spin around so maybe I just don't know. It seems like it should go through like a processing thing. Maybe there was a processor placed right here to refine it. Let's see if we have one. Let's see if we can fix this. I should have like a component factory, a scrapper, fabricator, and a refinery. Let's stick a refinery in the middle here. Maybe, maybe it's supposed to go like right there. 
Is that going to suck it out and stick it out behind? No, it goes out on that side. Okay, let's, let's see if we can turn this around. All right, if I stick it there and then turn it that way. Okay. That doesn't look like it's going the right direction. So I'm trying to see if we can get it to bypass. Oh, you know, I wonder. Let's go right here, maybe. Let's see, can we stick it in this hole right there? Nope, that's not doing it. Okay, I'm gonna figure this out. Okay, I got it doing something. So it's taking the wood, processing it, and then it's sending it, oh, it is doing something. Okay, so we're going around. That's weird how it does that. That's a little hack trick, I guess. So then it's coming around and going into these things. So, all right. I don't know if this thing needs to be this big, but I got it sending something off. Interesting, okay. Well, we have a lot of parts to this, so I saved it. I just don't know if it's, it looks like we offload onto these things right here. And then it takes the conveyor belts down. Wait, we have some over here too. What do these do? Where, I mean, what the world? Maybe something got blown off. <laughs> uh, all right. We're just going to leave it like that. And then I'm just going to kind of like recycle it and we'll use it to make a, a big super factory. I'm starting to learn like a lot of how this stuff works. So I think I can design a little bit more I mean, it's kind of a crazy design layout, but I think we can do a little bit more efficient layout here. So let's do this. I'm gonna, I've already made a copy of, oop, I don't mean to do that. Let's suck that up. We'll get all those yummy parts and we'll go to the next mission here. I need the sun to come up so I can recycle my, or recharge my batteries. Now, I need also to find like what to use fuel with. I seem to have like these fuel burning little reactor things and it seems like they generate power for my vehicle, but I haven't messed with them yet. I don't know how to get fuel. Got somebody coming in. All right, not the time I need you coming in. Oh, somebody else, little guy. Okay. Let's go over here. We need to go to the supply drop. Oh, there's another thing over here we need to go to. Oh, there's a Black Ops Pit Viper. That sounds cool. Let's go do that. Like, I'm kind of like, I don't really, like normally when I make my videos, I have like some sort of like plan <laughs> of like what I want to do on in the video, you know? And with this game, I just don't know. Like so many things are popping up every time I go to a trading station. We get new, new quests and things, and some of them are like repeats. And I just right now don't have any idea. So I'm just really trying to collect as many parts as possible. Wait, we're going. We're supposed to go to the supply drop. Let's go this way. And once I get enough parts and kind of figure out how to make a refinery base and all that stuff, and earn a lot of money or whatever then then we'll start figuring things out a little more i guess i don't really know i don't know if there's really going to ever be a game plan in this particular game it's just all over the place which i i really like that's why i stayed up so late messing around with stuff there's just a lot to figure out okay what do we got going on over here okay i really need our I need the sun to come up so I can regenerate. Let me tweak around on some stuff real quick and then I'm gonna recharge and maybe maybe we'll figure out like, maybe I should figure out like this uh, battery, not battery, but this, what is it called? Let's see if we can find it over here. Fabricate furnace, I think it's called a furnace. Rotating anchor, what is that under power maybe? It's a battery pack and anchored, Geocorp anchored furnace. So I, f I feel like we have to put stuff in this, right? So where do I, where do I put this? How big is it? Okay, it's that big. 
don't really have a lot of places to put a furnace. Maybe I should extend my vehicle out a little bit more and we'll get a little bit more real estate. Okay, let's, let us let me tweak around for a second. Okay, so I made some tweaks to our little tech vehicle here and I got this crazy <laughs> furnace generator collection system on the back of our unit. So it's probably gonna get blown off in two seconds. So I don't know, we'll have to see. But right now the way that it's working is I have a little furnace right here that is collecting wood chunks. And then I have a little filter silos right here that are filtering only wood chunks from whatever this collector is grabbing off the ground. So when I run over trees and stuff like that, then this will suck up, you know, whatever stuff falls on the ground. And then this will only bring in the wood. I don't know if I can, you know, use the, use other materials in the furnace or not, but I know I can do the wood. So I guess we'll just go with that. And then when the sun goes down, we'll see if we can actually still generate power and recharge ourselves off of some wood. So that's the plan. I don't know if it's going to work but we will see <laughs> and see what happens. But let's go in and take out this little battle area over here, whatever this is, it's going on this supply drop because we have some bad dudes over here and we need to find, okay, there's a kit box somewhere in the area. Man, always having to find a little kit and we can make it up this hill. Dang, I got those things on the front of my vehicle. It makes it hard to go up the hills now. We're gonna have to go around it. Let's go this way. There's something under me. Seems like I can't steer as well anymore. Since I put the big tires on the front, I don't think I can steer as easily. All right, let's take out this guy. Holy cow. Like a little, little rover. Okay, let's suck up this block here. Where is it? That thing. Okay, is there somebody else over here? There's somebody behind us. I think he's in the trees over there. All right. So our power goes down. Oh, it's too late. Another tech. Okay, we have to go get this thing. It's up on this hill. If I think if we destroy the tech, maybe we'll get the resources. I forgot it's a time-based situation over here. Knock all this stuff down. Enemy down. Now go get the toolbox. Where is the toolbox? I don't even see it. Uh. Oh, there it is. I see it up there. Okay, let's put this down. Suck up all these. I don't know what this faction or whatever this uh, corporation is these parts for took my magnet off i'll have to put my magnet thing back on Let's see if we can make it up this oh my gosh we can't can i go up backwards will that work okay we're just gonna cheese ourselves up this little hill it's these things that are on the front see they're hitting the ground so i need to figure out maybe i should turn them around okay so that thing's gonna dump all the parts right down this hill let's get close enough so we can oh my gosh that's a crazy place to put the chest okay you go get sucked up in that thing or not there it goes what is that that's a cool looking thing okay so now we gotta get off this crazy spot and then i'm gonna go up here where it says the almighty cube mighty and then the almighty okay that sounds a little crazy. So we'll put a flag right there just to make sure we're going in the right direction. I think this is probably a main mission thing. Good grief, I'm stuck again. Okay, let's go. Okay. The sun is going... Whoa, there's a whole little crazy thing going on over there. What in the world? This looks like a place I'm going to die. Oh, there's a red... A red bot. I'm going to go around over here. I keep calling them bots, but whatever. Tech bot, tech machine, tech rover. I don't know what they're called. They're called techs. Okay, so let me save real quick. All right, and then we're gonna go ahead and recharge real quick, and we'll we should see this little generator kick on and start doing some stuff here in a second. 
I guess it'll start up after the solar panels. Maybe they just go one by one. I don't know, it's not doing anything now. How weird. Maybe if I put one of these in that silo. There we go. Why is it not going into that? All right, I'm gonna take this out. And then where is... So that silo doesn't actually, doesn't actually do what we're hoping it would do. So let's just remove this thing and put the other little collection thing, right? We'll put the small one on right here. Oh, dang it, that's not what I wanna do. Can you face the right direction? Not upside down, dude. How do we make this? I mean, we just hit, keep hitting the same key over and over. I don't really know. Right, put that there, suck up all these parts. But see what's happening? Oh, it, it's not, it's not, uh, whatever, doing that thing with that. So these, okay. And then we're going to pull this out. Will it recycle whatever that is? What is this? No, that's rubber brick. So it doesn't do the rubber brick. And this little silo. Wherever the... What? Oh, shoot. Okay, hang on. Done messed it up. Okay, one second here. Alright, guys. So... I spent some time messing around with this crazy little refuel system and look what we have here real quick just before we go into this battle zone over here because I know all this is going to get blown off but at least I like understand kind of like what's going on. So this thing is picking up resources and it will pick up just any and everything. I don't know if there's one later that we can get where we can only tell it to pick up a certain type. That'd be great. And then it's going along this little conveyor belt right here. And then it has two options. So what happens in this one is that this one has a filter on it. So we go over here and I chose to filter the firewood. So that will filter firewood and only allow firewood to come up here and get stored into the silo. Cause I was having a problem with everything getting stored into the silo and it was just driving me nuts. So if it doesn't, if it's not firewood, then it will actually go this way. And then this little deal will actually tell it to drop anything else so as long as you know like let's go here i'm hitting the wrong key but let's just go to this tree right behind me and we're going to run over it because that's the easy thing what is it did i, did I miss my okay <laughs> i have my drill things up there so yeah so we're running over it just like this and then let's collect a variety of resources here gosh some of things getting harder and harder to turn okay so we can kind of see what's going on. So see, that's wood and it goes through. This isn't. And so what happens is it just falls off the end. See, falls off the end. Uh-oh, good grief. So, oh no, we got like a stronger dude right there. Okay, there we go. Took care of him. So yeah, so that's how it works. And so now when we go to anchor our system down, it will process the fuel and maybe it'll restore our, our batteries a lot faster. Now it's daytime, so, you know, it doesn't seem to make much of a difference at the moment. But at nighttime, I'm hoping we'll be able to repair our vehicle and generate some power at night. So if I could store like some wood and stuff like that. So we will see. All right, let's go over here and do this other thing disconnect and we're gonna go finally do this mission I got this thing here I need to pick up whoa that is not what I meant to do wow okay so this thing's super far look how far that grabbed it okay let's collect that I don't think I have any other stuff laying around do I no these are all little factories that are supposed to be making money okay let's go in over here I'm gonna save all right so we have this red guy over here. Oh, we have this other dude. I don't know, is that red guy bad? Really? OK, 
Okay, what is it? What is it? Okay, so we are we in the challenge thing? Man, I, I can't read and fight at the same time. The leader also gave me this block catalog. What a ripoff! Did he? What is he out of here already? I'm not sure what just happened. Okay, one sec. Oh, there's parts right there. Get away from my queue. Who do you think you are? Whoa. Move your tech up. All right. And I can see you. Okay. You guys got to read all that. Let me, let me collect this stuff or maybe I should set that. Maybe we'll set this back over here, like right there. And then if we get into any little battles, Oh man, I can't get up on that thing. I want to turn these things around. Let me see if I can turn these like that. There we go. Maybe that'll help us get up on stuff. Okay, so who are we talking to? That's the almighty cube. Looks like a bunch of armored stuff. Are we Are we talking to you guys? Over here? Who are you? We're talking to this transformer looking thing. Are you here to purchase one of our block insurance plans? What? Right choice. Okay. Are you here to challenge the almighty cube? The almighty cube. Okay, we got these two guys talking. Is he talking to me? Look at those puny guns. What are you going to do? Okay. Is he talking to these guys or is he talking to me? Let's see, I'm gonna back up here. Oh, sorry, bud. So are we supposed to, I guess we're supposed to attack this dude. Let's get a good shot on him. Can I target him? It doesn't let me target. Okay, we're just gonna go right here. We, are we doing any damage to this thing? 20 seconds. Oh my. Okay, there's nothing left. <laughs> okay. Yeah, well, you told me to mess it up. What? Are you guys attacking me? Yep. Okay. Not to press charge this time. Consider yourself lucky. In exchange, I'll sign you up for a batch of something. Make sure to transfer into my account tomorrow. What in the world? Whoa, look at that thing going up. Yeah, I don't, whoa. Okay, I don't think I'm going to be transferring any money. Uh, let's grab that thing. Stick it over here. I'm not really sure. You got to be a speed reader, man. Figure out what the heck they're trying to say. It's a lot to, to read and fight all at the same time. <laughs> Okay, so we got that. That was a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Nope, that's not what I want to do. Let's recharge for a second. We use our little fuel power. I guess that's charging our batteries. I sure hope it is. It's. Uh, I can't tell if it's going any faster or anything like that. And also, I don't know if we're using any fuel over here. So it, we may just, this may be just... A pointless thing on the back of my machine. I am certain you guys will let me know. <laughs> so, all right, let's stop this now that we're all charged and we'll go over to the next thing. So we're right here. 
And this is like a group of dudes that we probably need to take out. So let's set our marker there. And then right here is another bomb command. Bomber command. Okay. Let's go over here. Go up this way. That little thing's working pretty good back there, though. I might be able to use that for some other... Whoa, those guys are right there. They're all stuck in that little canyon. I'm going to try to take them out from over here. I don't know how I'm supposed to get over there. My guy's too big for all that. Blow those rocks. Okay, somehow we've completed the mission. gonna be able to suck all that stuff up there it goes yeah the distance on this thing is great wonder if there's another one we can use got like a new cab or something okay what's the next thing let's go right there put our marker right there and we'll head over to that side I haven't seen any other different terrains, you know, like, I mean, besides on the other side of the map. Over here, I haven't really seen anything. Oh, there is something over there, though, that just popped up. Way over there in the distance. Is that a base? Have I been to that base? Oh, no, that's, that's like right there. Oh, that's a fort. Okay. Well, we'll get to that area here soon. This is like another Blackhawk thing. Ooh, can we make it up to this? Oh, I'm so glad I turned those things around. That makes a big difference. This looks a little sketchy. Okay, let's save. All right, we're all saved up. Ooh, that dude looks mean. Hello. The new pilot. Straight to business, yes? Okay. The Rocketman crew have proven. Man, three rogue A turrets right in the middle of our busiest air traffic. We need you to take the 14 Blackbird plane fitted with Paladin bombs. Whoa. Fortunately, funds do not allow us to give you, give contractors like yourself Blackbird or Paladin for free. You'll have to buy it from us, although we reward handsomely for the mission. Okay. Either way, bombs are... So, pilot will accept this mission. Oh, we have to go over here. Right click on the screen to buy a Blackbird. Ooh, that looks cool. I think I saw one of those blow up earlier. Do you want to buy a Blackbird for 50k? Yes. Oh, it's gonna land on me. Well done, good choice. You're not going to regret this. Okay. Okay, so this must be our first little flight mission thing. Cool. Let's do this. Okay, so we hold shift, turns the propellers, and then, okay, left and right, and then up and down. All right. There we go. And then how do we fire? Oh, okay. So, command. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh my gosh. I didn't realize we cannot let off the shift at all. Okay, where am I supposed to go? It, it kind of wants to nosedive a lot. So we're supposed to find this target and then destroy it, I guess. This does not look like a good area for me to be in at all. Uh. Oh, okay. S stay high, avoid the ground. Okay. So are those things going to shoot us if we don't? Oh, those are, aren't they? Okay. So am I supposed to shoot those things? Okay. Now what? Oh, they're firing at us. Okay. I'm just trying to line up. That's a wonky missile, man. Is that going to hit? 
Whoa, they got like guided missiles, man. All right, let's try this over here. Oh. Oh man, I need, I need like a lock. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh man, this is why we're supposed to stay up high. This is tricky, guys. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Where's my wing? Uh-oh. That's not good. Oh no, I don't have any bullets. I mean, bombs. That's no good. Can I repair up here or anything like that? Hmm. This is hard. This little pea shooter is not working very good. Okay, let's go see if we can find our vehicle. And then I'll make a better plane or something. I don't think we're going to be able to complete this mission without all our wings. And I don't have the bombs now. So now I just have to find my vehicle, wherever the heck it's at. I'm going to come in here. Oh boy. Okay, so let's save a copy of this crazy thing real quick. Save. And then we're going to get in our vehicle. Okay, those dudes are gone now. So that is one of our missions we're going to have to complete. So let me suck up this thing into our inventory to fix it and make something better, I think. Something I can control. So that's going to be one of our next missions. Uh oh, who's coming in? All right. So one thing is we've lost some power. It is nighttime. Let's put down our charging thing and see if this thing charges us. I don't know if it's going to do that or not, but let's see if it does anything like that. I feel like we should have some other kind of con Oh no, look, it's, it's working. It is working. So now we're charging. So that's going to fill. Oh, look at that. We're actually charging at night. Holy cow. So now I can disable it and we hold on to all of this stuff. And we are now able to keep our shields going. Holy cow. That's fantastic. Okay. Because that's when I've been like dying the most is at night. And I'll get into a big giant fight and they'll tear down all of my defenses and shields and protection and auto repair and all that stuff and then i'm out of juice like you'll see this bar go down really fast in, in, a, in a battle so now i can like charge ourselves up and get it all good okay so one thing i did notice over here was that we do have dangerous attacker man we do have all these trading stations so let's make it to one of these let's go to this one try to clear up some of this area over here a little bit now that we're all fully charged with fuel. So what does this other fuel meter do? Like, how do I know when, like, when does this go down? Is this like for when we are running like engines and things like that? Okay, let's get this dude here. Dangerous attacker, man, is not very dangerous. Okay. And let's go get this guy. Whoa. And it's all like in the camera's face. Okay, suck up all those parts. Maybe we'll grab some over there too. No. Nope. Okay, so we have that thing is right down there. I'm just gonna fire all these guns, knock down all these trees and stuff. That's a nice, makes a nice little path for us. There we go. Got that dude dropping in. Take him out real quick. Good deal. All right, so we can repair at night now, and then we can open up the map. There we go. Oh, we got a charging station, Spider King. What the heck? Crown Top Hill Fort. Okay. And then we should have a bunch of challenges here on our mission board. These are far away. If I click it again, usually get like a couple more incoming okay 
And then if I do it one more time, we're good. Okay. So let's see if we can make anything over here that we need. Okay, I'm buying some stuff up. I got like these laser cannons. We're gonna have to try those out. That's new, I haven't seen that. And then over here, I saw something else. So here are the laser cannons. And then, what was it? Ooh, we can buy that, that's 30 grand. Whoa, okay, I'll save that for later. So over here, we have the little pacemakers that make, thing go, make things uh, go faster on our processing. It's eight of those, I'm just gonna buy all of those. And we have bought some other stuff there. <laughs> Got a little carried away. Rudolph knows. Magnet switch, two way explosive. I don't know what to do with that. And more conveyor doodads like this. I want to grab just some of these more because I don't have very many. These are kind of actually really helpful. I'm get some more of these guys. Okay. Hawkeye Fabricator, I think I have that. Here's the Future Sky Anchor. That's what I have on my vehicle right now. Might get one of those just to have it as a backup. There's a booster jet. Wings. Okay, I don't see anything that like is for the Blackhawk wing that we just broke off. So that's a hover ring. Oh, that looks cool. That's four of them. I'm gonna grab all four of those. And this is a future small ion drive. Grab that. And then this looks like a tail wing. We're gonna get that because we're gonna need to do some flying here soon. These look like left and right wings. Okay. And actually they're cheap enough. I can get two each. And this looks like a rudder. Okay. So we can build a whole little vehicle right here. Okay, that's an airfoil. All right, so we're gonna experiment with some building a flight thing in an upcoming episode. All right, so we purchased everything from here. Good deal. And that thing sucked it all up. So we now have all of that in our inventory right now. So we should have a whole flight section. Ooh, look at this. Oh, we may actually have parts. Well, maybe we don't. We broke off part of our wing. Yeah, right here. So we need another one of those. And I think also maybe a tail wing. I don't know. Anyway, oh, right here, one of these. So, all right, let's go we decouple our thing. We're all charged. Oops, hit the map. Let's go check out this incoming thing and see what that's all about. Normally I'm like battling these guys. You gotta help me. Okay. Oh, dude, you're gonna have to back up. Let's see. There. That helped. Oh, we got another dude coming in. Uh, okay, I was trying to put down one of these things so I can suck up all the parts before they go away. Anybody else? Oh, here we go. Nice. Got another dude coming in. Wow, he even must have made some people mad. Are they going to get harder? Oh. Man, there's a bunch coming in. Are you you're not going to do anything? Can you move out of the way then? Anybody else? Oh, we got one more. Oh yeah, getting bigger. Don't attack my thing. Uh, 
Uh, oh, thanks for saving me. I'll join your fleet now. Really? Mission complete. Oh, smack. That gets me every time. Nice, man. That thing has a great range on it. So I can, like, become this dude. Oh, he's got, like, little boosters on him. So how do you make the rockets go? Uh, oh, there we go. Holy cow. <laughs> so that is, like, hitting control key. So we can, like, turbo. Whoa. All right. Oh, my gosh. Whoa. All right, let's take a little snapshot of this little buddy. And before I destroy it. He's got like a weird wheel sticking off on the side. Oh, it's a little radar thing. Okay, cool. I don't know what we're going to do with you, but... Oh, is he going to follow me around? Wait, it looked like he was... Can I tell him to follow me around? He's doing something. Oh, idle, rename, switch tech, guard and follow. So he'll like literally follow me around. Look at that. I didn't know that was a thing. Okay. Cool. So can I send him off? to wherever land okay guess we just did that so let's do this and then there was something else really close right by us we have all these bad dudes over here I need to set up some mining operations to make some money all right let's go over here this is pretty close oh that's a big dude all right let's take this save oh, somebody just came in over there oh boy all right we're just gonna like Oh man, I just fired a shot off at him. Dude. Spinning around. Okay. Are we... Are you nice? Groundhog. They got me. Those creeps. Oh, you're missing some components. Oh, dude. Okay. Are we have to go in there? Uh... And he makes flies all the time. He comes more fl I'm getting out of here. Flies? Oh! Shoot. That didn't look good. Oh, there's little flying vehicles. I'm not sure I'm set up for flying vehicles, guys. Can we get these? Sure. Can I just click on them? Will that help if I target them like that? Okay, I think we got one of them. Not really sure. Okay, there goes another one. Alright. Oh, wait. Oh, shoot. You're a little too close there. Okay. We spin around. I'm going to have to depend on my mortars to get these guys. Uh, come on, maybe we need to go up on the hill and just plant myself there and recharge while we fight that guy. Did we get him? Where? Did we get him? I'm not sure we got him. Oh wait, I think he's behind us. We need to get closer. And I demolished this whole area. My crazy thing. We're getting him at all? Jeez Louise. Alright, let's take this. Maybe we can suck him up or something. Uh, is he still flying around us? How are we supposed to get that thing? I can't fire up in here. Ah, oh, look at that huge thing that just landed over there. You got some missiles on you, bud? Mm. 
We need some missiles. While that thing's flying around, I'm gonna look for weapons that are missiles. Hawkeye mortar. Let's see, we have machine gun, SMG, Hellfire rifle, catapult, monster mortar, plasma jaws. Ooh, missile pod. Heck yeah. Give me this thing. Where can we snap this thing? Uh, can I put it on top of this? Ooh, look at that. I can. Oh, shoot. Okay. We have any more missile pods? We have another rail gun, that crazy thing. And then we have these lasers that I haven't done anything with yet. Put the lasers up here. And I think we're gonna pull that thing off. Pull that one off. Can we move this over a little bit? Nope. And let's put this one right there. And I think, how, how does the laser look? I don't see if the laser do anything. Okay. Now that we have the missile pod, maybe we can, I don't, I can't even really see it, but it's right there. So we've got two missiles on it, mounted on top of our other cannon, a bit overkill. Okay, so let's go see if we can take out this little fly thing. Wherever the heck it's at, where did it go? It's stuck in a tree over there. Okay, let's see if we can lock onto it. Maybe that'll help us. There it goes. Oh, yes, nice, okay. Definitely the missiles were the thing. So let's take this. Oh, I didn't mean to put two of them down. Okay, so took care of that fly guy. And now I'm guessing we're gonna have to go inside of this thing. So let's line up to get a good shot inside there. Looks like there's another flying thing inside. Great, hey. Okay. Wait, who's trespassing in the lair of the Spider King? Why oh, does look like a spider? He's got a sore throat. What are you doing in my fort? I know the door was open. Uh, I'm gonna attack. Oh, are you attacking us? What the heck? Oh my god. That was not what I was expecting. Oh, we did it? Guys, dude's still coming. that thing down there we go oh my gosh dude they just keep coming man you guys are gonna keep giving me parts I'm just going to sit here and suck them all up while I'm destroying you guys is that guy in here? The Spider-Man dude? Oh my gosh. Oh, he is. He's right there. Stuck over in a corner. Oh, we're getting hammered. Okay. We're gonna have to charge up here for a second and heal. Okay. We're all healed up, so I think the tactic is target the spider guy, the main dude, and then see if we can get him taken care of for Oh, what are you doing going over there? No, no, stop. There we go. Let's see if we can get this guy. We might need more missiles. get closer it's got to be taking this guy out right and 
How hard is this guy? Oh, my thing is taking damage. All right, well. Oh, no. Oh, bro, why is it? again. Man, how hard is that dude's shield? What the heck is going on? We're gonna have to heal up again. Okay, let's get in here like this. I'm gonna put down my anchor block. Can't. Wow, how, how hard is that guy? Do we have to do something else? Like maybe attack some of these other things up here? Kill all the little fly guys? Oh, there we go. Wow. That dude was hard, man. Put this down right there. Can I grab that? Oh, man. All right, cool. So we took care of the Spider King. So that was pretty cool. That was, dude was hard, man. I don't know what kind of shield that thing had, but... It was insane. So we need to get some more missiles. I don't know if we have... Did we collect some? Doesn't look... We got a Zeus laser cannon now? Oh my gosh. Hawkeye spider mandibles. Okay. Whoa. Alright, so we need to make some missiles. This might be a good little place for a little mini base. At least it's kind of protected. So, pretty nice. Okay, well cool. Well, I am... Probably going to end the episode here. I think we did quite a bit of missions today. We'll have to go get this supply drop, and there's a definitely have to figure out how to make a flying machine. So I may experiment with trying to do the flying thing, get a little better at that, off off camera or whatever, you know, and see if I can figure a better way of making a ship that can get those pillars that we were attacking earlier. That was tricky. So. Anyway, well, I appreciate you guys watching. Definitely appreciate you guys leaving all the comments and stuff. It's really been helping with game and progressing and all that. So hopefully you guys are enjoying the episodes. And like I said, I appreciate it. And I will see you guys in the next video. Make sure you like and subscribe. Hit the little bell notification. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks.